Hey guys, Mike here and in this clip I'm going to tell you how you can customize the lock screen on your Galaxy S4. By default, the lock screen looks like this. It's pretty simple, with few details displayed and you can swipe to unlock it. However, this phone unlocking method allows anyone to access the content on it. That's why you might want to use some sort of protection. Besides swipe to unlock, the S4 allows a couple of different methods to open your phone from fancy ones like voice or face unlock to simple and efficient ones like pattern, pin or password unlock. You can access all these features by opening the settings, my device, screen lock and lock screen. From here pick the one that you prefer. In the next seconds I'll show you how to set up pattern and password protection. But the lock screen can be customized beyond that, by adding widgets and icon shortcuts. Most of these features however only work with the swipe unlock option. Ok, let's activate shortcuts. From the settings, make sure the shortcuts options is ticked, then tap it to customize the displayed icons. You can add up to 5 different apps here, you can change their order and you can of course remove and replace those already existing with others. With shortcuts activated, from the lock screen you can tap and swipe from one of the apps to directly launch it without having to unlock the phone first. Lock screen widgets are an addition brought on by Android Jelly Bean 4.2. On the S4, you can choose between several different widgets for your lock screen and you'll be able to access them by swiping the upper region of the screen to the left or right. However, I'd be careful with the widgets I'd add here. Don't put anything with private data, like your Twitter or email accounts. Also, I've noticed that adding lock screen widgets would cause the phone to react a lot slower when pressing the power or home buttons in order to unlock it. That's why I for one have disabled them after a short while. Anyway, that's about it for now. If you're looking for more advanced methods of customizing your lock screen, leave a comment below and I'll make another clip on that in the near future. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up button if you like this video. I'll catch you in the next clip.